Hi guys, happy Monday. So today I have another haul for you and today is sponsored by Timu. I did get these items through the influencers program. So let me show you what I found. I found this and this is, it says that it's 80 pieces and it's called White Craft Material Paper Book and it's a Voyager Diary is what the theme of this one is and it was $2.49 and they're just basically um, like travel I guess tickets and so I thought that these were fun they do have other themes and I just went with this one so here's this and they are um, tickets I don't think they're let me see okay yes they are perforated so you can rip them so you can see that here so you can rip them and then rip this. So there's one ticket. So I thought these were fun. So let me see, one, two, three, four. Okay, so you get four um, sheets per um, image. So here's this one. And then here's this one. I love the suitcases on that one. And then we have this and this and that's it. So there's there's those. I thought those were fun. Again, $249 for this set. And then we have this one. This is it says it's a hundred pieces. But in the description, it says it's 102, so. Um, it's 102 sheets, vintage, non-sticky scrapbook paper. So these are these are not stickers. And this one is in the theme Notes Island uh, for $1.99. So let's see these. I love that they put this little jute on there to kind of keep it together. Cute. So they give you these, oh, this is probably the two extra. <laughs> Cute, but these are these are more of the hard card stock, but the glossy. So there you go, they give you two extra ones. So love that. Okay, let's see these. It looks like a lot of these are going to be, okay, so these are in the shape of an actual tag, but I love how tiny these are. Isn't those, aren't those pretty? And then let's see. So it looks like you get two of each. Oh, that looks like it's embossed. That's cute. Love that. So a bunch of tickets in this one. Okay. Yeah. This one's Led Zeppelin. This one's The Smiths. This is Railroad Company, Pink Floyd. Um, this one looks like an airplane. Yeah, from Europe to New York, cute. Um, more tickets, come on. So there's these. Yeah, I love these. They look like either tickets or labels. These are nice. I like to use little things like this to kind of decorate either a master board or tags, labels, all that fun stuff. So then there's these. This one's in the shape of a tag. So are these. And then here's more tickets. <clears throat> Excuse me. The Ramones. Then you get this size. I love that you get different sizes for these. And different colors. The colors are pretty too. Yeah. The report card. Yeah, those are cool. And then you get these. Receipts. <clears throat> 
some ledger application for admission to the pink pussycat college <laughs> oh my goodness ay 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 education library i just had to read that one didn't i and then this one train service between london and south wales that's cool okay so there's that love these i love all the little tickets and everything that's that's really cool so this is a really good set. I really like this one. All right, we're not gonna fuss with that. Then, ooh, let's see. These are 10 sheets. Um, let's see, what does it say? It's 10 pieces green field vines and they're hollow borders for $1.99. And I'm sure I could have maybe looked for some type of die cut or something oh, let's just take the whole thing out it's getting stuck in this little vellum label so let's be careful there it is Ooh, but look at how delicate these are oh those are pretty look at that are they all different i think they're all different so you get greens beige and grays in this one look at that Look at that. Yeah, that looks better against my sweater. Oh, this one's a heart. Very cute. Wow, these are really pretty. Yeah, so these are the grays and then you get a couple of the beige. And then there's these. Very pretty. Those are nice. And again, these had, um, these sets had different colors, um, but I just went with the more neutrals, the greens. I think they had pinks and other colors like that. But I like to use, I like to try to get things that I know that I could use with any, with like neutrals to where I can use with any type of project is what I'm trying to say. This one says 50 pieces, ticket themed stickers. So these are stickers and they're, in the theme fair, F-A-R-E, for $1.99. And I know that they do have more of these, retro, journey retro tickets. The packaging is cute too, isn't it? Wait, what's happening? Oh yeah. Okay, let's see this one. So 50 pieces for $1.99. Let's see, what kind of stickers are these? I'm sure it's said in the description, but you know, your girl doesn't read. <laughs> I don't read descriptions or directions. Okay, so they're washy. But, oh yeah. So it looks like you get two strips of each. So they're perforated, so you can rip these apart too. Look. Ooh, I love that. All right. So there's those. Let's see. You get two of each. Yeah, these are all perforated. So then these look, these have the little hole things to where you can have that little side little punch. So those are neat. These are also, they're all, they're all perforated. So, oh my gosh, love these. I think I'm definitely gonna have to go back and look because I think they did have other themes and I believe they were in other colors but again your girl does neutral and so I thought that these I always like to try at least one pack to see how I like it and then if I like it then I, I always end up going back to get more so here's more of these yeah these are good look at those Yeah. Again, you have the little hole on these so that you have that same, that little edge there. Yep, definitely gonna go back and look at the other ones to see which other ones I wanna get. So it says 50, but it's actually 50 strips, but you still get like, this one has four. You know what I mean? So you get four stickers 
you know, like you get eight of those, you get four of these, you get four of those. And so even though it says 50, it's 50 strips, but each strip has at least two or more. So love that. I'm definitely gonna have to go back and look at the other ones. So there's that one. Again, it says 50 pieces, ticket themed stickers. And this is in the theme fair. So there's that one. Then I have a couple other paper um, packs. These are 30 sheets and I think I put it, let's see. It says uh, 30 sheets retro floral landscape scrapbook paper. This one is green forest for $1.99. And this one is purple water lily for again, $1.99. And they did have other colors. I remember that. And I, but I just got, of course, purple and greens. That's, that's kind of my jam lately. So it looks like you get three of each. Oh, wow. And they're like nice. They're not like super thin, but they're pretty thin. Let me move that. So you get three of each of these. But man, that looks like, like real stuff. You know what I mean? Like it has, um, like that look to it to where it looks like if it's textured but it's not love that so here are the purple there's a lot of frames in this okay this one's not but look at that with the chipped paint and everything let me see. i was going like this sorry <laughs> but so that you can get a better look but those are gorgeous yeah, okay. I think I might have to go back and get the other colors because these are beautiful. So there's those. I'm gonna have to figure out a project to use these in. And these are the green forest. Look at how pretty that green is. So again, three of each, right? Yeah. So there's these. Man, that green is beautiful. With the pillars on this one. Look at that. Wow. Just the crackling and everything. It's so pretty. I love that. I want to learn how to distress and make it look like that. See? I have the crackling paste and everything. I'm going to have to play, do a good play with my stuff to see how I could do that. So there's those. Yeah, but these are gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. I think I put, there's one last one back here. So there's those, yeah. Those are absolutely gorgeous. Okay, so there's that, I think. Oh no, I have one more thing of paper. So this I thought might be fun to play with. So this is cooking paper, which is the parchment. And this is in the vintage newspaper. I believe they had other um, prints, but I got the vintage newspaper and this was $2.79 for the roll. And let's see what this looks like. Ooh, <laughs> these are cool. So you get the little arrow sticker thing, but look at this. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love it. Sushi burritos are over the top in a very good way. <laughs> oh, these are cool. This, not these, this. Coffee drinks, steak, a claim at the bar. Oh my gosh, look, look at that. The good food times. <laughs> April 1st, 2020. Oh, I love that. Let me see, does it just keep repeating after that? Let me see. Yeah, how to pick a wine store, yeah. So this is it. This is the whole piece that's not bad. And you get this much in the roll. 
So yeah, not, not bad. I'm gonna have to figure something out with this too. This is fun. Let me roll this back up. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah, I'm happy with this. So I have to figure something else out, but I love that. Does it say the, of course it's not gonna say it in inches. It says in, um, it says it's five meters. So I don't know how long that is, but yeah, this is really cool. I'm really, really happy with this. That's gonna be fun to play with. So there's that. I think that's all the paper. Okay, let's go into the, I got a die cut, I mean a die, I got an embossing folder and a stencil. So this one is called the Brick Wall Cut Out Background Die, and this was $1.49. To be honest, I mean, again, I didn't check the size, and because it's done mostly in like centimeters, I'm always lazy to try to go in and figure out, like Google it to see. Come on, you need to come out. What's happening? There it is. So it's plastic in a plastic again. But look at that. It's a little brick wall die. So I guess these will be cute for um, tags. So I might have to make a tag with this. But isn't that cute? It's teeny tiny though. That's the only thing, but it's still cute nonetheless. I will still definitely use it. So there's that. Again, that was $1.49 for that die. Then I got this. I was into really I was really into looking into brick brickwork. <laughs> because I just thought that it was so cool. So I, I was looking at another die that I might end up getting just to see if it's bigger. Um, this one is Street Corner Retro Classic 3D Embossed. It says embossed flower on it, but it's it's the brick, it's like a brick wall. And this was $3.49 for this 3D embossing folder. So let's see if I can figure out where to open. Here it is. It's always hard for me to figure out where to open these. So it, it's gonna say, um, because all I have to do is cut and paste from, from the Timu um, app, it's gonna say 3D embossed flower, but that's not a flower. It's gonna be um, the brick wall. This is the only embossing folder that I got. <gasps> wow, that feels so nice. Ooh, this is gonna be fun to play with. Can you see that, the brick? Yeah, that's gonna be fun. That's gonna be fun. I've been wanting to kind of play around with my my embossing folders, so we'll have to do something with that. Then this one is called, it's a stencil, Bark Crack Background Stencil. Bark, like tree, crack, background stencil for $1.49, and that's this one. So I thought this might be fun to kind of add to my background stencils. So there's that one, just to kind of get a better idea. So yeah, that's really cool too. I like that. I'm curious to see how it'll look once I use it. So that's gonna be fun. Okay, next let's go into um, more of like the hardware kind of stuff. The tools. This is just a regular awl tool, which some people call the little pokey tool. And I just bought this one because first I liked how thin and skinny the point was. Because the one that I have, um, it's more like I guess what is it? Maybe like in I think it was in my sewing kit. And so I just feel like it's a lot thicker. And so I thought this one would be better for me to use whenever I need to um, like a poke a hole or something in my, in my, for my journals to bind my journals. So it's cute. It's little. And then I love the wood, the little wooden handle. And this was only 79 cents. So there's that. 
But yeah, I just thought, 79 cents. Let's go ahead and take it. I did order more of the Steampunk Gears. This one says that it was 20 grams for $1.49. So let me just look really quick. I, I noticed when I made my Steampunk, um, the um, tags, that I was kind of running low on my little gears. And so I thought, let's get another little pack. So I love this one. I think you can get these in either all um, silver or all gold. And I got the mixed pack. And so you can see some of these are gears. Um, gears, duh, they're all gears. Some of them are charms. So that one has a little charm. And you can use, you can actually put any of these as charms. So there's a little hand, the clock hand. What is this? I don't know if that's supposed to be in here. Yeah, I don't know what that is. But yeah, they're teeny tiny. They're a lot smaller than I thought that they would be. I thought they were all going to be around this size, about these sizes. But that's okay. I can still use them. So I thought those were nice. So there's that. Let me put this back in the little baggie before I lose some. Okay, so again, that was uh, 20 grams for $1.49. Then I found this. This is called the a mini electric engraving pen and it's cordless for $1.98. So I thought because I have a lot of these little um, metal pieces like little charms i thought that this might be fun maybe to kind of write something on it so it does need a battery it doesn't come with the battery i'm gonna have to uh, check to see <clears throat> oops oh that just came all the way out so to see where where the battery goes i'll have to look at the instructions for this i'm definitely gonna have to have instructions but yeah let me see let me just take a quick peek Um, how to use unscrew the bottom of the engraver pin and insert two uh, AA batteries. Hold the engraver pin like you would hold a normal pin. Hold the power button down with your thumb as you engrave the surface. Oh, okay. So it takes two AA batteries and then you push this pin down. I mean this pin, this button down and then you need to, then you can start engraving. So, oh, not bad. Very cool. I'm gonna have to try that out. Let me know if you want to do a video of trying out these things. <laughs> that might be fun. Might be short, but it'll be fun. So let me know. We can try it out if you're interested. So there's that one. Then, this is my first time ever buying any type of ribbon. And this is one yard of embroidery lace ribbon for 99 cents. And so I thought, let's try it out. I have seen others like hauling a bunch of lace and stuff. I have a lot, so I really didn't need any. But I thought, let's give this a try. I thought that this was very pretty. So not pretty. So it is a yard. And so I just thought that this might be fun to play with. 99 cents so yeah I thought that was pretty so there's that and last but not least I got this this says it's one box of premium mixed packaging randomly sent dried flowers so you don't get to choose what type of flowers you get you just get the package and that's what they send you and so this was $2.99 for this box of dried flowers. So let's open this up and see how these are. I just thought that these might be fun to use like in um, 
like in the little specimen slides or something. Come on. There it is. You know, you open one corner and then another one closes. There it is. All right. So let's see. Ooh, these are pretty. Look at those. Look how pretty and delicate those are. So you get a bunch of those. And then here's, oh my goodness, I don't even know what to take out. Then here's these. Wow. Those are pretty. Then you have these. Oh, they're pretty. I'm not sure which way is up on these. Looks like maybe this way, right? Because this way looks pretty too, but I think it's this way, right? I don't know. Let's see this one. Oh, wow. Look at those. Okay, let's see what else. They're very, um, they're not crunchy. They're very soft, so which is really good. Look at that. You get a bunch of these, which is re really pretty. I like that a lot. Okay, delicate, delicate. And you get these little spiky things. This pretty little thing. That's beautiful. And then you get more of these. You get this little feather looking thing. That's pretty. And there's this. I think the red maybe dyed it a little bit. I think these are baby's breath, but they're painted red. You get a bunch of those. Yeah, they're not crunchy. So that's really cool. I wish, I wish they wouldn't have painted those all red. Then you have this little thing. But very pretty. That's fun. Let me put this stuff back. Wait, this goes over here. Put this back. I'm gonna try to package it up the way they gave it to me. And we have these. And these went like this. And then all of these came down here. All right. Well, that's it, you guys. That's everything that I got this time. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, all that jazz. And that's it. I will see you guys tomorrow in... Um, our tag Tuesday. I do have a tag that I want to share with you. So we'll do that tomorrow. But um, a big thanks to Timu um, for this um, influencers program. I love working with them. All of their stuff is so much fun to look at. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, again, share, all that jazz. <laughs> and I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks, guys. Bye.